Beast Man, Gene Parsons. David Manning is your referee. What news? Boy, Flair thought he was off the hook, but little does he know. And as Fritz said, we will know more next week. The way I understand it, the boys deciding among themselves and each just foaming at the opportunity. As Fritz explained, there are times when adrenaline and motivation allows us all to rise above our God-given ability using even more than our wonderful talents at whatever we have that talent for. Mentioning that we all have talent for something. And this may be the time, folks. Wow. Here we go, the Iceman and Freebird Roberts. Iceman with the celebration music. And his entrance tonight. An old feud between these two. This was going back to the Freebird hair cream and Roberts losing his hair. After Roberts had cut some of Iceman's off in previous weeks. How could you forget that? And it's obvious to me that one of these two do. Listen to these blows. Freebird Roberts out on the floor, the Iceman jiving in the ring. I know that when the house lights were on a minute ago, you could see the tremendous crowd that's in the building tonight. Texas Stadium, May the 6th, but afternoon card, the perfect time of year. A uh, delightful spring afternoon. Memorial to David Von Erich, Texas Stadium's Parade of Champions. There's the drop kick from the ring. Really great to see Fritz to visit with him again. I know you enjoyed it. He had a tremendous ovation when he stepped in the ring before he came back on the air. Like this is for the Iceman, Roberts. On one side. Robert's upside down in the leg scissors. Fritz also thanking the millions of fans worldwide for their wonderful support. Oh, look at that, a little pile driving move during the tragedy. And I know many of you have expressed interest in the Temple Baptist Christian Academy's fabulous gym they're building. The record that has been made by Glenn Cozum. Of course, as you know, the uncle of country star Ricky Skaggs will be on sale and proceeds from that record called Heaven Needed a Champion, of course, going to that memorial. Jim Robert chasing the ice man who's on his feet again. Flying there and Roberts across the head. A knee. Roberts clipping that knee. We saw that in our first stop too. A dangerous move. And of course, Robert's being a free bird will not worry about stooping too low. Well, the ticket office is informing me that the crowd is in excess of 8,000 now and still coming in. The only reason why we can get that many in is because we've had added extra seats on the floor, elevated ring sides, and get about 1,200 more in than usual. 
Down of one. Roberts has been reaching down there for the tights. He's got him again. And David Manning will have none of that. Roberts with the drive. minutes are gone as Roberts has temporarily disposed of Ice Man Team Parsons to the floor. Professional wrestling not only drawing tremendous crowds here but everywhere as we continue to be the number one fundraiser for non-profit organizations. Iceman has got Roberts out of the floor around the post. He's got several options. Which one will he exercise? There you see it. Bad punishing the free bird. Ice bad punishing the free bird who's in the corner. Look out, Roberts trying to hold on. It may not do him much good. Here's the Iceman with a pin, but with a tight, Robert pulls him away. A little slam there to the Iceman. Friendly hello. Headbutt. There's a chop by Parsons. There's a pin. Again, he had the tights when he pulled him off. A kick from the rope. And did you hear Fritz mention the bout with Kamala? The great Kabuki coming in with Hart and Akbar. Gary Hart and General Akbar to be there. to the right, in an uncomfortable position. He holding the upper torso of the body as he did so. And Iceman now moves back to his feet only to receive more, I'm afraid, from Roberts. He has him and scrapes that forehead across the top rope. Iceman checking for blood while Roberts chases him into the corner. Look out, here they come. Throws into the floor and starts out after him. David Manning stopping him. They've got him out here, and I'm going to get out of the way before it gets worse. And it's getting worse in a hurry. in the ring. The ice man's going to make him pay now. <laughs> Robert's back in the driver's seat now. Robert charges the ice man all the way. Robert is home. Upside down. Ice man just now noticing. Robert's pinned upside down. Dean Parsons from St. Louis. Rose line by the Iceman. Here's the pin. And the Freebird says no. Robert's calling. 
The turnbuckle. Down, and he hits something to ring. I stand with the reverse headbutt. One, two, three. I stand with it. Iceman King Parson. Iceman King Parson with a reverse hit butt has won our bout here. And we'll be back with more championship sports on Channel 11 in just a moment.